Hey, this is Allie Edwards, and in today's video, I'm introducing you to our travel collection for 2022. I'm gonna dive right in and start off with the album options. We did three albums this time, one six by eight album, which is this lovely, uh, very neutral linen with a neutral interior for those of you that are neutral fans. We've got you covered with this very, um, very straightforward, I think, is, is the way to call it. Lots of different page protectors in there. Love how it turned out. It's nice, super simple, especially if you if you like the linen ones. This is a nice one that you can add. It's a little bit warmer than the linen that we have previously offered, which was a gray. Let me show you guys the difference between that. The last time we did a linen, you can see the difference here. This one is a cooler linen. This was the one that we previously offered, and this is the one that we are doing with the travel release. So linen, six by eight album. And then in addition, to the six by eight album we obviously still have a variety of, of albums that are available in the shop if you're looking for something else but we wanted to try something different with our albums this time and just mix things up and so what we decided to do are these buildable albums so these are albums that come with chipboard covers the same kind of chipboard that you would get on a um, actual bound album or the the you know albums that we usually offer but this is going to give you a lot more flexibility in terms of what you decide to add into your album we don't have page protectors that go with this one but we do we are doing a 10 by 8 also so this is a 4 by 4 and then we're doing a 10 by 8 they have nice big rings on them so you can fit a variety of things they're two inch uh, rings that you can you know take off add on maybe you want to do ribbon instead or something else this is kind of a throwback to different ways that we've approached many albums in the past you know many years ago for those of you guys that have been around a long time it's just kind of rethinking some of the ways that we used to do things and see if those are still relevant for today. Especially for those of you, I think, for travel that like to work outside the page protectors, I think this will be really fun to bring in more travel ephemera, more opportunities for pockets, lots of different things that you can play with with uh, these particular albums. So that's the 4x4. Four four. And then, like I said, we also did a 10x8, a nice simple grid on the outside, plain on the inside. This one can fit 10x8 page protectors. I just grabbed a 10x8 page protector or 10 by 8 page from my December daily last year. Let's see if I can get these guys open here. I want to show you how page protectors can work inside of these if you're still if you're wanting to do a mixture. Again, this is the 10 by 8 size there and it can fit right inside of here. Again, you can add six by eight page protectors in here. You can also obviously do some pages that are a little bit larger too, or a little bit taller if you're wanting them that way. Uh, but this is just a nice, I think it's nice to see that this is an option. You can do that, or you can also just work outside of the page protectors and then add in the pattern papers. Like here's one of our 10 by eight pattern papers. These are sized to the outside of the page protector. So the same size there. And you'll see more of the patterns that we have in just a couple of minutes. Uh, but these ones you can just punch holes and then add and add them directly into the album. All right, so in addition to these buildable albums, which we just think are gonna be fun and just offer you a different opportunity, right? To document memories in, in a different way. We are also doing some page attachments and the page attachers look like this. We've got a three a three hole one and then a six hole one here too that you fold over and then you can put these into the album itself. Get these guys in there. And then you can put a page or a pattern paper or something else in between or on top of these, right? Depending on what you want to do. Let me just find a scrap piece of paper here. Let's say you wanted to, here's something that I had been working on previously. Let's say you wanted to adhere this onto this page. You could do it just like this. This will be my, you pull the adhesive off the outside edges. And then you can just set this in here and go ahead and adhere. Actually, it's probably gonna be easier if I take it out of this thing. Just like that and then you can peel the adhesive off of this one and then add it in so this is going to be great uh, the smaller ones the three hole ones are going to be great for um, the 
three, the four by four album. And I'll show you that in just a second here. Obviously then you would trim this down, but I just kind of wanted to give you an idea. One of the reasons why we wanted to do this specifically for travel is because when you travel and you are gathering ephemera or pieces of paper or bags or stuff that maybe you don't want to punch holes in, then you can have a page uh, attacher just like this. So then we also have the smaller one that will work in with the three, three ring one, right? To be able to go into this smaller album. You can also use the three ring one in this like this, and maybe you wanted to have just something out here. Maybe you only wanted it, you didn't need it, need it to be in all um, six holes. So these are some options also for getting things into your album, right? We want, we want to make it easy for you to get stories and ephemera and photos and all those other things into the album. So we've got the six hole option on the page attachers and then the three hole option on the page attachers. All right, next up, let's take a look at the main kit, the travel main kit for 2022. This kit is going to come in this string envelope, super fun pattern on there, the banners. This would be great to either add into your project or you can even go ahead and cut all of these out if you wanted a bunch of uh, additional embellishments there, but that's what this kit will come in. Let's start off with one of the first things I wanna show you is this giant go, right? The word go, great for the outside of an album, great for the inside first page. You could stamp all over this. That's probably what I would do, um, like repeat stamp all over it. You could put other embellishments on top, lots of different things that you could do with that large word. Let's start, let's just, we'll go around the, uh, my little circle here. Actually, let's start this way. I pulled these out of the chipboard backer, but these are the chipboard pieces that are included in the kit. Adventure Begins, Explore More. That one just turned out super cute. This is one that has a bunch of the uh, triangles. This one says, get out of town. This one says, not all classrooms have walls built around them. That we've got choose your own adventure there. And this one, which has a really light uh, pattern of buildings on it. We've got one here that says, go your own way, a banner, a fun stripe here, here and there. This one's got little stars. We've got happy, go lucky, adventure, wander, just live, and the story. Those are from the chipboard backer that I've already taken those out. This, this kit also has another set of chipboard in it, which are these, uh, they're like navy blue, dark navy with gold. This is the life for me. These are all chipboard. It's our th nice thinner chipboard. Our little getaway adventure awaits. Don't forget to live. I left my heart here. Let's go somewhere. Just book the trip and go. My favorite place, last minute experiences and traveling here and there. So that's a fun set of chipboard. We've got two, two sets of sticker sheets I've already taken these off the back because I was using them for one of the kit photos and I just put a foam adhesive on the back of them. That's why they're not still in their uh, backing, but they're a fun mix of um, the black and then this other color there with icons and or words on them. So book the flight just for a moment, travel, the journey, car and a bike and a bridge, here and now, explore. Then we have this fun set of cut out cards that could be used for a variety of different things and you could paint on these. The first one says, away we go. So then we've got one that says time for adventure, just something fun, right? With the die cut out of them. And then the let's go somewhere. I also think these would be really cool, like on the inside of an album um, to get it started or on a piece of vellum or a transparency. I think that would be super cool. This set also has a bunch of four by four cards with that kind of air mail outline. I think there's eight of these. These are great if you're using the 10 by eight album size. We've got a four by four pocket in there. And if you're not doing a 10 by eight album size, you can always cut these down to three by four, which which would just have the lines along uh, the top and the bottom there. We've got a few journal cards available in this particular kit. Let's go ahead and look at the four by six first. We've got exploring uh, there. We've got this one that says time for a new adventure. Here we go. Uh, fun icon one. And then staycations are my kind of travel, right? There's still lots of people loving on, on staycations. Also additional sentiments here. We've got fill your life with adventures, have stories to tell, not stuff to show. Then we've got here there and everywhere. I love waking up in the morning not knowing what's going to happen or who I'm going to meet or where I'm going to wind up. That's a fun one. Um, the word adventure there. Uh, this new journey, a little icon pattern 
another one. This is in the three by four with the stripe on it. And then just a cute little one with um, some stars along the bottom there. So a few, a few uh, different cards there to hold stories from your travels. Then we've got, we've got, let's see, two more things here in this main kit. We've got these uh, fabric stars. These have adhesive on the back of them, kind of a gingham check in a few different colors. I think those turned out super cute. And then we also have a set of plastic circles here. A couple of them have gold foil and then the other three have black on them. So let's go somewhere adventure awaits I always love layering these like these that's one of my favorite things to do is either add journaling in the middle or add a photo add another embellishment my favorite place I left my heart here uh, not all classrooms have walls around them I love that one too and then the gold ones say uh, staycations are my kind of traveling and leave behind your worries at home. So that is, again, that's the main kit. All right, next up in our 2022 travel collection is a mini kit. And we have two options with this mini kit. You can either get it with the notebook, with this traveler's notebook that I will show you in just a minute, or you can get it without. So we have two different options for that. It does come in this really cute craft uh, pocket or craft uh, envelope here. Super cute little pattern on top of that. With the notebook, I think that this notebook is also gonna be offered by itself. I need to check on that. It's either just within the bundle with this kit or probably on its own as well. And this does have printed travel interior pages on it. So choose your own adventure. It's all about the journey here, there, and everywhere. Uh, super fun house pattern there big like postcard, some just really cute designs on the inside, some sentiments like this, work, save, travel, and play, repeat, up in the clouds, grid-based pages here with those. Um, these icons are gonna see in just a minute. So a bunch of cute pages. There's the end, the Ferris Bueller quote on the last page there. Um, explore, just a great, a great building block, right, for a travel project. That pattern turned out super cute too. Um, we got the US map on the inside there. So that is, like I said again, included. Uh, you can get it as a part of a bundle with this mini kit or you can just get the mini kit on its own. So let's look at what's included in the mini kit. I wanna start with these because these are one of my most favorite things probably in this collection these are vellum titles and they've got gold foil with some fun other colors happening on there so we've got wander and holiday i know some of you guys don't call it um holiday doesn't mean christmas right holiday means vacation and then we've got explore here too so those turn out super cute then we've got a couple different puffy options or these are included with the kit i put foam adhesive on the back of these because i was using them in a photograph and i needed that extra little bit there but you don't have their adhesive on the back this one says here there and everywhere and this pennant says giveaway then we have a super cute set of little small tags or like half size tags i think these are so great for travel uh, they're just a really nice sized embellishment. So the journey begins uh, here and now, here and there, live in the moment, that's one of them, explore your world, and then follow your heart. Super cute. I love these. I love these also because if you wanted to make these longer, you could pair them like with a photo on the bottom. You could pair them with some journaling or a piece of cardstock underneath or just a colored cardstock too. Then the other thing, there's two more things in this kit in particular, and these turned out super cute, which are a bunch of different places around the world. Like their little icons, so Lotus Temple, the Eiffel Tower, that looks like a church. Uh, let's see, the get, the Gateway Arch. There's a whole bunch of different ones. A London bus, Acropolis. I'm trying to look at them while I read them to you guys. Machu Picchu. It's kind of would be if you love to travel and you've gotten to go to a bunch of these places, it'd be really fun to uh, mark them all off. This is a castle somewhere. Stonehenge, uh, Edinburgh Castle, Notre Dame, Notre Dame, uh, Santorini, the London Eye, uh, Empire State Building, the CN Tower. I think that's in Toronto, right? Uh, that looks like the Coliseum. And the Sydney Opera House, some of these just iconic places, the Taj Mahal, uh, Golden Gate Bridge, Great Wall of China, uh, The this is a hotel in maybe in Abu Dhabi or Dubai, one of those big hotels there. Um, the Trevi Fountain in Italy, the Leaning Tower of Pisa, that's also in Italy. I think this is Big Ben. Yep, these are so fun. The Louvre in Paris, the Pyramids, um, Sydney Harbor Bridge, uh, Alhambra, Alhambra, some of these I'm not sure what that one was, um, the Washington Monument, 
And this is the Ellis Island immigration. So I've actually been to a bunch of those things. I definitely want to try to make something using the places that I've been. I think that's super cute. And then the last thing that's included in this little mini kit, we did um, flags here. These are fabric, so they don't have adhesive on the back. So you'll want to add that on yourself or you could staple them. Um, blue skies and open roads, but it's like a canvas. It's like a black canvas with white. Adventure awaits, take the long way home. Born to Rome, favorite place, don't forget to live. Let's go somewhere. And then this one said, all good, says all good things are wild and free. So that's the mini kit. Let's see what else we have available with this collection. All right, with our travel release, this time we are offering some 10 by eight pattern papers that work great in the 10 by eight album. And let's go ahead and take a look at these. Many of these can be cut down uh, depending on what size your of a project you are doing. Even this one right here, the one that says journey, this could easily be folded in if you are doing a uh, six by eight album you could fold it in and you could have uh, your photo on one side something else on the other side so we'll just let's go through and see the different patterns in here this is that little houses pattern I think this one's so cute I love how that uh, turned out these are single sided there's that gingham pattern in the green uh, nice icons, travel icons, that's in a green also. These are tickets, they look like tickets. You can easily cut these up into little ticket shapes. Such a fun pattern you can build on top of there as well. We've got the stars. We've got the United States, like a little map here. We've got these that also can be cut out, right? Different things that you could use that could be in a variety of different projects. I love cutting stuff like this out, so that's probably what I would do uh, with this one. Another big one with the, the stripe border there, the airmail border. Here is the patterns, um, the little banner patterns. I thought that one turned out really cute. I like how that one came together. This one just says, I never want to stop making memories with you, right? I think we did this on a on a transparency one time. I really liked how that one turned out too, but I love it on the black there. This is a grid similar to what we did for December Daily last year in the 10 by 8 papers. Always a good one to revisit. Great for adding on little embellishments, adding on photos, adding on little memories from your trip. Here's all those icons that are also included in the mini kit. Um, yes, the mini kit, they've got, those are in there as transparencies. I don't think all of these were in there, but many of them, uh, but a cute pattern paper also. This one's just a fun little uh, hand-drawn map. Love how that turned out. Let's go exploring, that's super fun. Journaling can go here, a photo could go here, lots of different things. Um, also, this one turned out amazing. There's the wander on black. Again, it can be cut up. You can add other things on top of here. All good things are wild and free. Love how that one turned out. And this one right here too with the gold foil vacation, adventure, wander, explore, travel, holiday, getaway, go. You can cut each one, each one of those out. They could become um, embellishments on your page or you could build your page using this as the background. So that's the 10 by eight pattern paper pack. All right, let me introduce you to a few more things that you're gonna find in the shop for our travel collection for 2022. First up, we did a chipboard alphabet set. These are have adhesive on the back of them just a really super solid uh, chipboard alphabet. I've been wanting to have more alphabets again, so hopefully we're gonna see those coming out in some of the upcoming uh, releases. So we've got this one for this one. These again are all individual shop items. Then we've got these two planet flags that turned out super cute. This one says, let's go exploring. And this one says, adventure awaits. Just love, love how they turned out. Then we have a set of pockets with uh, cards on the inside of them. Let's see, there are six of them here and they all have to say something on the outside. So wander, explore, let's go, adventure, journey and travel. And then on the inside, they all have just a little card with a little tab. So you can see that you can pull those out. So on top of those, you could have photos, you could have journaling, you could have memorabilia, lots of little things that could go on top of there. And I love that these could be the jumping off point inside of uh, the little four by four album. So here's that four by four album again. You could totally end up adding these in here, especially using some of the attachers that we have now. Um, and I'll, you've either seen these already or you're gonna see them in a few minutes uh, that can be attached into here and can hold this in place. Actually, let's just, I'm gonna open it up and show you guys right now. All right, so these attachers come like this. They can be folded over and then added into the rings of the album and then you can 
use the adhesive to hold this in place there. And I'm not gonna do that on this one right now because I don't know that this is exactly how I wanna use this, but then this can go inside the rings and you could have it be a part of the album. So super cute. All right, so we also have two fun sticker sheets this time. These are using some of the icons that are on the those little transparent squares that are in the mini kit. Some of these are the same, some of them are different, but places around the world there. Um, one sheet has places around the world and then the other sheet has uh, like adventure or travel sorts of icons, right? Cars and uh, camera and an airplane, uh, different things like that. These are two separate sticker sheets. All right, another thing that you're gonna find in the shop this time is are some really, really large wood veneer pieces. And I wanna show you guys how big these are compared to the, like the, on the 10 by eight album. Here's the 10 by eight buildable album, but I just wanted you to be able to see how amazing <laughs> these could be on the outside uh, of those. There's a few different words in here. So I'm gonna actually just leave this here and we'll look at them this way. Look and yes and up. Right, that's always a good one. There's one big says rest, like rest up. You can do a whole album. We've got eat, roam, fly, and away. There's the eat. Now these came back a little bit different than we had anticipated that they were going to be. They're a little bit bigger um, and they have some other like little burned things on the back of some of them that we didn't really love. So you are gonna see a price discount on these guys, but they still super fun, super usable. The away one comes with two uh, in two words there so you can put it together on top of there like that. But fun definitely can find a use for those probably in your projects. All right. and. And last up for our travel collection, we have four new stamp sets, two that are six by eight and two that are four by six. First up is an alphabet. And one of the things I wanted to show you guys is with this one was compare it to another set that we have released previously so you can see what the difference is. I think this was with uh, maybe December Daily last year, I think we did this set. So a little bit of a difference. You can see like in the K's there, this one is is a little bit thicker. It has a thinner line on the inside. And it is a more like, it has some distressed edges around the outside there too. So different font, uh, but I wanted to be able to compare the two so you could see. Um, one of the differences too is see how the lines go all the way to the edge, like here. And on this set, the line stopped in the middle. But anyway, just to show you the difference, I'm a huge fan of Alphabet, so I like having a, a wide variety of them available to uh, me when I'm working on my project. So that's the first one. That's just the Alphabets. The next six by eight, or just the Alphas, there's no, there's no numbers on this set. Uh, the next one is a really cool set, which is a buildable set. It's got a variety of titles that you can pair with these blocks over here. And that is similar to this design from the pattern papers. So you'll be able to take any of these titles along the edge right here and then orient it this way. You can pair these as a title along the top. So you'd have the title and then a block below where you could add your journaling or a photo or something else. So all of these can be paired uh, with these along the edge. And then there's a few uh, cute little icons on there too. All right, then for four by six stamps, we have two four by six stamps. The first one is a banner set with some outlined ones with words on them and then background. So you can uh, paint, you know, use paint. You can use different colored inks for the background and then for the top. This one also has let's go stay a while and fly away along the bottom there. So those are similar to one of the patterns. And then this one here, which is probably one of my favorites. I love a classic circle stamp set. This one says collecting moments, not things. Wherever you go, go with all your heart. Life is short. The world is wide. Good friends, great adventures. To travel is to live and take only memories, leave only footprints. And these guys are are about they are looks looks like they're a little bit bigger than one and a half pretty much one and 1 1.75 is probably the accurate uh dimension on those but those are the stamp sets we have available with the travel collection this year as always if you guys have questions on any of the features in this release let us know in the comments below and we'll see you back here again soon